as we get into the outflow tract here, we do see that there is an intraventricular communication that lives between the Y of the septal band. So here is the cranial and the caudal limbs of the septomarginal trabeculation, and the intraventricular communication lives right in between the cranial and caudal limbs of the septomarginal trabeculation, also known as the Y of the septal band. And here's the tricuspid valve leaflet. So it does look like the, post the postero inferior rim of this communication is in fact muscular. So a muscular outlet defect. Interestingly enough, we see that there is a great vessel that kind of overrides this defect and it does appear to be the aorta. And so here is the aortic valve that we see overriding the intraventricular communication. We'll get back to that a little bit later, 